This is 360 Current Affairs Trending News Report. The East African coastline was predicted by the weatherman to face the wrath of Cyclone Hidaya. Well, Kenya missed its first cyclone hit in history. Here is why. Ever wondered why cyclones don't cross the equator? Well, picture this. A cyclone is like a rebellious teenager. It doesn't like rules. And crossing the equator? That's like asking it to tidy up its room. Just ain't gonna happen. Why so, you ask? Well, it's all thanks to our friend, the Coriolis Effect. This invisible force born from our Earth's rotation is the chief puppeteer in the atmospheric theater directing the paths of winds and ocean currents. But at the equator, this force goes on a coffee break, leaving cyclones without a director and causing them to lose their way. Now let's talk about our latest guest star, Tropical Cyclone Hidaya. She's been making headlines, huffing and puffing her way across the ocean, but when she tried to RSVP Kenya for a visit, the equator was like, not so fast, sister. Because of its proximity to the equator, Kenya was spared Hidaya's full wrath. Imagine the equator as the bouncer at a nightclub, and Hidaya is the rowdy partygoer who's had one too many. The equator's like, nuh uh, you're not getting in here, and sends Hidaya packing. In the end, Hidaya had to grudgingly respect the equator's authority. Fine, she probably thought, I'll just go wreak havoc somewhere else. And thus, Kenya was saved from a disastrous dance with Hidaya, thanks to the equator's strict no-cyclone policy. In conclusion, the next time you're at the equator, take a moment to appreciate its role in keeping cyclones in check. But remember, while the equator might be the world's best cyclone bouncer, it doesn't do much about rain. So Kenya, you may still need to repent as Prophet Dr. Owar announced, because clearly the angel responsible for the floodgates of heaven are still not too happy with you, as you can see. So you might want to pack an umbrella. Go to the nearest church and seek to be right with the heavens. And, on that note, here's a little weather pun to brighten your day. Why don't clouds like to quarrel in the summer because then they would have a heated argument. Stay safe, stay dry, and remember to laugh at the weather's little jokes. Until next time, this is your sophisticated witty weather report signing off at 360 Current Affairs Trending News.